Hi everyone, this next video is a relaxation guided meditation. We'll be starting off with some breath work, um, breath work exercise, and then we'll be moving into a short relaxation meditation um, guided through me. Um, equipment that you may need is really just a pillow or perhaps some blankets if you're feeling cold making yourself nice and um, cozy or the space around you nice and cozy. Um, you'll be lying on the floor. Option is if you are seated, perhaps bringing some height for underneath the sit bones, or you can also sit against a wall if that feels more comfortable, but it is a nice meditation to do lying down. Um, so let's get started. So getting nice and comfortable on your back, Feet can either be planted on the floor with the knees gently knocking in, or if you like, you can bring a pillow for underneath the knees to secure the lower back or even underneath the head. But from here, we'll start by placing the hands on the belly, just resting on the belly here, allowing the shoulders to really melt away from your ears, maybe giving the head a bit of a rock from left to right. We'll move into some breath exercise before the relaxation phase. This breath um, exercise is called Veloma breath. It's a three part breath where we do restrict the breath in parts. Um, this type of breathing exercise is really great for increasing your lung capacity and also energizing the body. Firstly, just sort of visualizing your torso. So from below your belly button all the way up to the shoulders or collarbones, um, dividing your torso into three parts. So the first part would be your base, so around the pelvis and pubic bone to just above your navel. The next section will be around your ribs and chest. And then the final section is around the top of the shoulders, collarbones, and even into the neck. So firstly, just taking a nice big deep breath in and filling up the whole space with your breath. And then just allowing the breath to float out of the mouth. Again, breathing in through the nose, filling up the base all the way up to the shoulders. And then exhale, just letting that release. We'll take a, a few more slow, steady breaths. And then we'll begin with the restriction phase. Breathing in and let the breath out entirely. Now on your next breath in, just filling up the first section, just to the first third to the navel. Hold for a count of four, three, two, one. Filling up the midsection, navel to chest. Hold for four, three, two, one. One, and then taking another big breath in, filling up all the way to the shoulders. And then releasing the breath out of the mouth. <sighs> Breathing in again, just into the belly. Hold. Into the chest and ribs. Hold. Right up into the shoulders. Hold and release the breath out. <sighs> Guiding you through one more time, breathing into lower section, hold. Breathing into midsection, hold. Full body breath, hold. And then release the breath out of the mouth. <sighs> if you're quite comfortable with the timing now, continue for a few rounds in your own time three part breath, slight restriction at the top, and really just allowing that breath out to be complete before starting your next round.
final round. And once you've completed your final round, just allowing the natural flow of your breath to return. Steady, slow inhalations and exhalations. So Veloma breath work is great to do seated or before a guided meditation or even before exercise or study for focus. If you feel like you need to move or get a bit more comfortable, now's the time to do that. I'm going to move the hands away from the belly now and just place them by your side, palms facing up. Arms are away from the body, so make a bit more space. Maybe bring the legs a little further apart. And then just letting the heels roll in and the toes turn out. Let's lift the shoulders off of the floor and then let them connect back into the mat, making a little bit more space there and comfort. And do the same thing with the hips. So engage the legs, lift the hips off of the floor and then let the hips just sink back into your mat. If it feels comfortable, close down the eye gaze or if you feel more comfortable with the eyes open, just soften the gaze. And start to tune into your breath. Just noticing how you're breathing at the moment, what your natural breath feels like. Is it easy to breathe? Or perhaps it's short or quite staccato in anticipation of this video. And then we'll begin to accentuate or change your breath assisting to relax a little deeper so here i invite you to take three really big deep breaths in through the nose and release out of the mouth sigh or sound is always welcome and with each exhalation Feel yourself letting go. Anything that does not serve you, release it out with the breath. And toes, feet, lower legs, upper legs hips heavy and relaxed. Torso, front and back, shoulders, arms, hands, fingers, soft and relaxed. Head is heavy. Muscles around and behind the eyes are soft. Cheekbones and jaw relaxed. Teeth just gently part. And this sense of a whole front of your body melting into the back of your body. Back of your body melting into the support of the earth beneath you.
in this warm flow of relaxation, watching, washing over the body, starting from the tips of your toes all the way to the crown of the head. This wave of relaxation washes back over the body from the crown of the head to the tips of your toes along with the breath. Every muscle, every fiber, every cell nourished and relaxed. Slowly begin to bring your awareness to sound. Noticing or pinpointing sounds that are further away from you. Drawing your awareness to sound outside of the room or space. Focusing your awareness on one sound for a moment, then letting that go and drawing your attention to a different sound. Just testing here how far your soundscape can reach. And slowly begin to bring your awareness to sound that may be closer to you. Sounds within the room or space that you occupy on your mat. And then shifting your awareness and attention to your internal landscape. Noticing the sound of your body, breath. Perhaps even tuning into the steady beat of your heart along with your breath. Noticing how the heart slows on your exhalation. We'll slowly start to bring some movement back into the body. We'll gently begin by brushing the thumbs along your fingertips. And feeling into sensation there of the fingers and hands. And then when you're ready, you'll begin to stretch the hands out nice and wide, spreading the fingers apart and gently curling in. Maybe doing the same with the toes, just giving the fingers and toes a bit of a wriggle out. Circling the wrists and the ankles. And 
and then taking a nice big stretch up and out of the body. They get long from fingers and toes. So you have full body stretch here, waking up the body. And then drawing the knees into your chest, give yourself a good hug. Maybe even lifting the head, neck and shoulders, nose to knees, curling through the back. And releasing here and then rolling onto your favorite side to support yourself if you're on the floor to come up into a seated position. Take your time to do that. Might feel a little bit sleepy or relaxed after that. If you're still in seated position, just gently opening the gaze now. Good. And we'll finish up there. I hope you enjoyed um, that mindful guided relaxation. Um, it's something that you can do when you're feeling anxiety begin to rise up or perhaps before um, bedtime um, to get you settled into some nice sleep. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you. Hi everyone, my name's Alicia. I'm a youth worker at Yarra Youth Services and I'll be guiding you through some short videos on self-care. Um, the videos are yoga inspired classes that can be done at home by yourself or with a group of people. Um, people practice self-care in many different forms and yoga and exercise are one of those um, forms to get you feeling good. Um, uh, these videos are downloadable, um, so you have access to them at any time. If you'd like any more information, please get in contact with us here at Yarra Youth Services, um, Instagram or Facebook page. Thank you, I hope you enjoy.